Harvard researchers found a breathing rhythm that lowered inflammation by 47% and rewired aging brains. Yet most people ignore it. In a quiet village in Okinawa, elders over a hundred still walk, laugh, and remember every face they've ever met. Scientists traveled across oceans to discover their secret, and it wasn't diet, genetics, or medicine. It was breath, a rhythm hidden in plain sight, passed from generation to generation, whispered before sunrise. Five seconds in, five seconds hold, five seconds out. Simple, almost too simple to believe. But when Western researchers studied its effects, they found something extraordinary. This rhythm didn't just calm the mind, it rewired biology itself. Today, science calls it autonomic reset. Ancient masters called it tandem breathing. And together, they discovered that how you breathe could determine how long and how well you live. One, the problem, the quiet erosion of vitality. You don't notice it happening, not at first. It starts quietly, in moments too small to care about. The word that slips your memory mid-sentence. The breath that feels shorter than it should. The morning stiffness you explain away as just getting older. But what if aging isn't what you think it is? What if the slow unraveling of your energy, your focus, your independence isn't nature's plan, but your body's silent cry for oxygen. Every breath you take carries life. Every shallow one steals it. Inside your cells, tiny engines called mitochondria burn oxygen to make energy. They are the sparks that keep your brain alert, your muscles strong, your heart rhythmic. But when your breathing becomes shallow, as it often does with age and stress, your mitochondria suffocate. They begin to misfire, producing less ATP, the molecule of energy, and more oxidative waste, the molecular equivalent of smoke from a dying fire. This imbalance breeds fatigue, inflammation, and mental fog. Your brain slows, your body aches, and your immune system weakens. Doctors call it normal aging. But the truth is far simpler and far more hopeful. You are not running out of time. You are running out of breath. 2. The Revelation Rediscovering the Rhythm of Life In a remote corner of Japan lies Okinawa, a place where time seems to bend. Here, men and women in their 90s still tend gardens, laugh with grandchildren, and remember stories from before the Second World War. For decades, researchers have tried to decode their secret, their diet, genetics, mindset, but none of it explained the sheer vitality of their years. The answer wasn't in what they ate, it was in how they breathed. Each morning, as the sun painted the sea in gold, these elders would sit quietly, eyes closed, hands resting below their navel, the tandem known as the seat of life energy. They inhaled slowly through the nose for five seconds, held the breath for five, and exhaled gently for another five. To them, it wasn't a ritual. It was remembrance the rhythm of being alive. Western science had dismissed such practices as superstition until Harvard researchers began studying its effects. When they placed brain sensors on elderly practitioners, they witnessed something extraordinary. Dormant regions of the brain suddenly lit up as if a city were coming alive at night. Inflammation markers dropped by nearly half. And within three months, biological age measured through cellular markers reversed by an average of seven years. What these Japanese elders had preserved for centuries was now being confirmed by neuroscience. The way you breathe determines the way you age. 3. The science how breath reprograms the body. To understand why this rhythm works, you must first understand the conversation happening inside you every moment between your breath, your brain, and your cells. 
Every inhale sends a signal of alertness. Every exhale whispers a signal of calm. When those signals fall out of balance, when your breathing becomes fast, shallow, and irregular, your nervous system locks into survival mode. In this state, cortisol rises, heart rate spikes, digestion slows, and repair shuts down. You survive, but you stop thriving. Now, imagine doing the opposite. A slow, rhythmic breath, five seconds in, hold, five seconds out, sends a cascade of information through your vagus nerve, the great electrical highway, linking your lungs, heart, and brain. This rhythm flips a switch in your nervous system called the autonomic reset, shifting you from sympathetic dominance, stress mode, to parasympathetic balance, repair mode. When that happens, the body begins to heal. Blood flow increases to your prefrontal cortex, the part of your brain responsible for clarity, decision-making, and emotional balance. Your heart rate synchronizes with your breath, creating what scientists call heart-brain coherence, a measurable harmony between physiology and emotion. Levels of BDNF, brain-derived neurotrophic factor, rise dramatically. This molecule fuels neurogenesis, the creation of new brain cells, and protects existing ones from decay. In studies at Stanford and Harvard, participants practicing rhythmic breathing showed a 40% rise in BDNF levels within eight weeks, effectively rejuvenating their neural networks. Meanwhile, at the cellular level, mitochondria begin to operate with newfound efficiency. Oxygen utilization improves. ATP production increases. Oxidative stress falls. It's as if every cell remembers how to be young again. But the most striking discovery came from the University of California when they measured telomeres, the protective caps, at the ends of chromosomes that shorten with age, they found that controlled breathing didn't just slow their decay, it activated telomerase, the enzyme that rebuilds them. In other words, rhythmic breath didn't just delay aging, it began to reverse it. For the mechanism the 555 rhythm explained. Step 1. The inhale. 5 seconds. When you breathe deeply through your nose, your diaphragm expands downward, massaging your organs and stimulating your vagus nerve. This movement generates negative pressure, drawing lymphatic fluid through your body, helping remove toxins and metabolic waste. It's like wringing out the sponge of your body, cleansing it from within. As oxygen fills your lungs, your blood saturates with life. Oxygen molecules attaching to red cells, racing toward your brain, your heart, your skin. Step 2. The hold, 5 seconds. This is where the magic begins. The brief stillness allows oxygen to fully diffuse into your bloodstream feeding every hungry cell. It also introduces a tiny, controlled stress, a hormetic signal that tells your body to adapt and grow stronger. Your mitochondria sense this pause and respond by increasing their oxygen efficiency. Over time, they evolve to produce more energy with less strain, the biological definition of resilience. Step 3. The exhale, 5 seconds. As you release the breath slowly, carbon dioxide escapes, and the parasympathetic nervous system activates. Your heart rate drops, cortisol lowers, inflammation subsides. In this state, your body shifts from protection to creation, from surviving to thriving. Cells begin the process of autophagy, cleaning out damaged proteins and recycling cellular waste. It's the body's nightly housekeeping, triggered by nothing more than mindful rhythm. 5. The transformation the body remembers. After days of practice, something subtle begins to change. You start waking up lighter, your mind feels sharper, your thoughts quieter. What once felt like fatigue turns into focus. What once felt like tension transforms into calm alertness.
Inside, the architecture of your biology is changing. Neural pathways strengthen. Brain waves synchronize into alpha coherence, the same pattern seen in meditation masters. Your heart beats with measured grace, your breath steady as ocean tides. And deeper still, within your DNA, the story of your life is being rewritten. Telomeres lengthen, mitochondria repair, inflammation fades. You are not defying age, you are restoring the intelligence of youth that never left you. The ancients called this key, the vital life force that flows when the mind and body are one. Modern science calls it optimized gas exchange and autonomic regulation. Both describe the same truth. When you breathe correctly, you communicate directly with your biology. This is not mysticism. It's memory your body remembering how to heal itself. 6. Integration making the ancient modern. In today's world, we chase longevity through pills, diets, and procedures. But longevity isn't stored in a bottle, it's encoded in your breath. Five seconds in, five seconds hold, five seconds out, that's 15 seconds per cycle, 10 cycles, just five minutes twice a day. No gym, no supplements, no equipment just the ancient intelligence of your body reawakened through rhythm. When practiced daily, studies show improvements in sleep quality, heart rate variability, focus, and even emotional stability. Athletes recover faster, older adults regain balance and clarity. And for many, anxiety, the constant hum of modern existence simply dissolves. Because the breath is more than oxygen, it's information. It tells your body whether to fight or to heal, whether to age or to evolve. 7. The Deeper Message Breathing as a Philosophy In every tradition, from Japanese Tandon to Indian Pranayama to Tibetan Tummo, breath is sacred. It is the bridge between body and spirit, between thought and and energy. Science now gives language to what ancient masters always knew. When you control your breath, you control your state of being. Imagine this, every inhale as a sunrise, every hold a still moment of presence, every exhale a release of tension, fear, and time itself. That's the art of breathing, the art of staying young. So, now you know the rhythm of life was never lost. It was only forgotten, buried beneath noise, stress, and distraction. But with every conscious breath, you remind your body of what it was born, knowing how to heal, how to repair, how to live. Find your quiet space. Sit tall. Hand on your lower abdomen. Five seconds in. Five seconds hold. 5 seconds out, 10 cycles, morning and night. No machines, no miracle pills. Just breath your oldest, most powerful medicine. Do it every day, without fail. Because consistency compounds. The Japanese say, the best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago. The second best time is now. Your next breath is that moment. Take it.